Yeah. It was that kind of night. Which you might call a bit rusty. I um, just shot 124 in the first game of the league. Um, strike shots kind of there, but I missed a ton of spares, including at least three or four really easy ones. My body's just out of sync. My approach is just funky. My release is kind of bad. Um, we'll see how it goes. I mean, I haven't bowled other than a little bit of practice in three weeks now. My body is still working on getting around what it's capable of doing right now, so we'll see. This is this is hard to do. I'm not lying when I say it's a little embarrassing. Um, except for myself, this is part of the process. This is what's going to happen for a while until my body is in a better place. So I have to keep pushing through. So for game two, I go 150 and change. Um, that included a pretty rough fall at on um, frame two. Um, foot stuck, fell out onto the lane. Right lane went in the gutter, almost sprained my ankle. So it's one of those nights. On the bright side, because I'm having to deal with terrible uh, slide sole, I'm trying to swap through all of them and tried brushing and everything. So just one of those nights. Um, I finally, I think, gotten my approach speed figured out in terms of what I wanted to do with my slides, so uh, happy luck there. I also changed to the uh, UFO alert for the first time in competition near the end of the second game. Um, finished with a good bunch of good strikes. Uh, finished with the last three in the tent, so liking them all so far. We'll see how we go into the next game.
was an exceptionally difficult night, though in retrospect, I'm at least able to come away feeling like I handled it okay from a mental game standpoint. My body is just not there yet and might not be for a while, but all I can do is to keep working and trying to get back to where it needs to be. That's going to include some pretty rough league sessions, which sucks, but it's a part of the process. I got home from that series and iced everything up and just thought through it. In earlier years, I might have handled a night like that fairly badly. Heck, even earlier this season I may have. But I'm taking the process of physical therapy and improving my body technique seriously enough that I can remind myself that there are going to be bad nights as part of it. And that's a pretty good leveling up on its own. I'm still uncertain if I'll be bowling this weekend at the March Metro Bowl scratch event. If I do, it's on Kegel Kegel Titanium, a 44-foot pattern with a pretty wide primary oil block. It'll be an interesting challenge, but one I'm hoping to approach well. If I bowl, the recap of that event will be my next video. Be sure to subscribe so you can see that video on your homepage. Thank you again for watching. Good luck and good bowling.